Hello everyone, in this video we will solve problems involving combination. So let us have item number one. A shake parlor has 10 different fruits. Sincha wants to buy one order with three different flavors. How many different selections are possible? So the first thing you have to do is to identify the number of objects and the number of objects you want to take. So, ang n natin, or the number of n, n is equal to 10, and then r is equal to 3. And then, of course, the word select, ang gagamitin natin dito is combination. So, combination of 10 objects taken 3 at a time. Okay? So, yung longest formula natin, pwede natin i-apply. And then, papakita ko rin yung short method. Okay? So, yung ating formula, combination of 10 taken 3 is equal to n factorial. So, that is 10 factorial all over 10 minus 3 factorial times 3 factorial. So, ito yung formula natin, di ba? n factorial all over n minus r times r factorial. So, mina minus yung 10 and 3, and then tina times pa sa 3, sa denominator. Okay? So, yun yung ginagamit. And then, of course, pahabain mo yung 10 factorial, expand mo, that is 10 times 9 times 8 times 7 times 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 all over 10 minus 3 is 7 factorial or 7 so 7 times 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 and then 3 factorial that is 3 times 2 times 1 Okay, so cancel cancel out yung pareho. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Matitira si 10 times 9 times 8. So 9 times 8, 72. Times 10, that is 720. And then 3 times 2 times 1, syempre divided by 6. 720 divided by 6, that is equal to 120. So, we have 120 ways. Okay? There are 120 possible ways of selecting 3 different, three, three different flavors from 10 different foods. Okay? So now, yung shortcut natin, mabilis lang, di ba? Ang R natin is 3. So, lagay ka lang ng tatlong line. And then, start ka kay 10. Then, bawas ka lang ng isa kay 10. Minus 1. So, magiging 9. 9 minus 1, 8. Okay? And then, multiply mo yan sa numerator. I-divide natin yung R, which is 3 factorial. So, alam naman natin, 10 times 9, 90 times 80. 720. Divide 3 factorial, that is 3 times 2 times 1, di ba? 3 times 2 times 1 divided by 6. So, same lang dito magiging 120. So, hindi mo na kailangan ipa-expand pa yung given mo. Pwede mo na kagad gawin ganito yung shortcut. So, let us have example number 2. The Drama Club is planning a trip to Philippine International Convention Center or PICC. While in PICC, they want to attend two plays out of eight plays they would like to see. Okay? So, how many ways can they choose two plays from eight plays to attend? Identify natin yung N. Ang N dito, yung number of objects or, di ba, N. So, eight plays. Meron daw walo na pagpipilian. At ang kailangan lang nilang piliin they want to choose from 8 place ay dalawa lang. So, R is equal to 2. So, simple lang. Identify mo lang yung N at saka yung R. And then, of course, choose. 
So, that is combination. Combination of 8 taken to. So, yung shortcut na yung gamitin natin. So, kailangan natin ng R dalawa. Then, from uh, 8, kunin mo yung 8, n is equal to 8, and then minus ka lang ng 1, 7. Times natin yan, divided by R factorial. So, yung R natin is 2, 2 factorial. Okay? So, that is equal to 8 times 7, 56. Divide 2. 2 factorial is 2 times 1. So, 56 divided by 2. So, sa 5, meron kang 4 and then 1. 4 divided by 2, 2. Then, 16 divided by 2, 8. So, we have 2, 28 ways. Okay? Meron kang 28 ways in choosing 2 place from 8. Pag pumili ka ng dalawa, out of 8 place, meron kang 28 ways. So, let us have example number 3. In how many ways can you select a committee of 4 students out of 12 students? So, again, ang una mong gagawin ay identify the value of n. n is equal to 12. And then, identify the value of r. r is equal to 4. So, meaning, you have to get 4 from 12. So, yun ang kailangan mo laging tatandaan. Identify mo si N and si R. Okay, now, ano yung kailangan natin gamitin? Is it combination or, perm or permutation? Nakalagay kasi, ano ang inatinatanong? So, what is asked? So, we have to find out how many ways can you select so, the word select, that is combination of force. Combination of 12 taken 4. Okay? 4 students out of 12. So, yung unang gagawin natin, yung pinakamadali na lang. So, R is 4. So, tatlong line ay apat na line. And then, start ka kay 12. Minus 1, 11. 11 minus 1, 10. Minus 1, 9. So, it times natin, divided by R factorial. So, ang R natin is 4. So, 4, 4 factorial. So, ulit, 9 times 10, 90. Times 11, 990. Times 12. So, that is 11,880. Divided by 4 factorial, so that is 4, 4 times 3 times 2 times 1, so that is equal to 24, so 11,880 divided by 24, 495. So dito, pwede na nang mag-cancel, like this one, 3, cancel si 3, magiging 3 to, tapos itong 10, magiging cancel natin, 1, 1, magiging 5, tapos yung 4, at saka 12, pwede to magiging 3, okay? So, ang natira na lang sa, sa numerator ay 3 times 5 times 3 times 11. Then, magiging 3 times 11 times 5 times 3. Okay? So, 3, 3 times 5, 15 times 3, 45 times 11. Okay? 45 times 11, syempre, 4 times 1, 4. 5 times 1, 5. Then, 4 plus 5 is 9. 495. So, 495 ways of selecting a committee of 4 students out of 12. So, yun yun. We have 495 ways. So, I hope you learned from this video. And if you learn, please subscribe our channel and hit the notification bell para updated kayo sa bagong video.